is this doing too much for a girl I just started dating recently? Unless she asked for pads, I'd say skip that and just get her food. Food solves everything. Include chocolate. She'll appreciate it. I'm going to go with the no pads too. Unless you know what specific brand and model she is using. Or you might just end up getting her pads she will never use seemed honestly, since you guys already have a usual FaceTime routine going. This is not too much. In fact it's pretty sweet. For real. You gotta know what flavor she needs. Whether it's the grape overnighters or the lemon liners. Does she feel red bullish and like wings or not? Maybe she's a straight tampon girl. Skip it unless asked. Get her the snacks and her favorite tiki art. Skip the pads. Secondly, it's called being thoughtful and considerate. You've been dating this girl for two months, not for two weeks. Honestly if a man bought me snacks and chocolates after two weeks I'd still be happy. So would I and am not even gay. Im buying you chocolate miking. 3. Showing someone you care about them isn't cringy or simpy, or whatever word people are overusing these days, to sabotage other people back quote s healthy relationships. Well put. Showing someone you care about that you care about them is normal. If that makes you a simp, then how's that a bad thing? Because unfortunately people these days take advantage of others kindness. Especially during date. You get treated like an option when you show your care too much. This is different though. Op has been seeing the woman for two months. Her actions imply that she's reciprocating your feelings. As a girl. I think it'd be super sweet, but maybe ask her if it's okay for you to drop by with some stuff, don't just show up without a heads up. Good idea. My ex did this for me only not the pad thing, and I thought it was adorable. He brought me flowers, chocolate and middle, because I was having terrible cramps. As a lady I think it would earn you extra points. It takes a thoughtful guy worth keeping to do stuff like this. Truth. F simping bro, that isn't too much. So many girls are out here wishing a guy would treat them like that. Ain't nothing wrong showing her you care. Go for it. Caring for someone is not simping. I wouldn't bother with pads or tampons. She's probably got them, and finding out exactly what she wants is tedious enough to take the charm out of it. Snacks and mid all seem like a nice gesture. I think the cringy, but you're afraid of is valid, and avoided by not making an overly big deal about it. Don't act like a hero. Or let her know, if you went way out of your way to do it. Don't expect a parade. You were just in a CVS of the neighborhood, and dropping something by and on your way. Don't expect any of her time. And I agree. Check that she's cool with it first. I disagree. And as a girl I think it's super sweet, and I don't think there's any reason for him to lie. Going out of his way shows he cares. But you were right and he definitely shouldn't expect praise or anything. My advice is to not seek praise. Which is pretty much always good advice. If he lets her know he went to a lot of trouble. It's too eager. Desperate for approval and puts an expectation on her when she's feeling shitty to make him feel like it was worthwhile. No good comes from that. Also it's not lying to leave out that he had to take two buses and walk a couple miles in 100 degree weather. It's just not making it about him. My opinion forget the extra pads. Just get snacks slash drinks, maybe something sweet and the restaurant food and you'll be her hero. Not at all. Super nice gesture. Not sure where the don't do it dudes are getting their intel, but as a woman, do it. This is thoughtful and very sweet, and when periods are really bad little things like this can help a lot, especially favorite foods. I agree with the ask, if you can swing by to drop something off first. But I definitely think this is a cute idea, as a guy I'm in the do it camp, so long as he doesn't go overboard. Though I would be hesitant, to buy pads without knowing brand slash size preferences. If a dude did this for me, no matter what point of our dating time, if immediately began to think of starting a serious relationship, most dudes, at least from my experience, get so weird about it, and sometimes treat women, like they are gross. This. I dated someone for two months and one time. He asked me what was wrong, and I said honestly, that I got my period. He answered with a He was 40, and had a daughter. 
I couldn't believe he responded like that. I dumped him right then and there. I'm tired of people treating us like something that happens to our bodies that we can't control is gross and weird. I think it's sad that someone who was supposedly a grown man who understood the concept of periods and on top of that had a daughter. A teenage daughter on top of that would respond like that. I'm sorry you went through that. I would have done the same thing. And from a 40 year old man no less. I expect better from 10 year olds let alone someone triple their age. Exactly. I was like. You understand the concept of periods. Correct? He was like yes. I said you also have a teenage daughter. Correct? He said also yes. I was like okay then you should understand that this is something that happens to us that we can't control. Would you respond to your daughter like that? Maybe seems petty, but it made me really question his character as a person. It made me view him differently. Sometimes somebody can do something that completely changes the way you view them, and there's no coming back from that. That would be a good example of that. It just got me thinking what else might happen that he tries to make me feel bad about. I know it was stupid but it just made me question whether he would start to try to make me feel bad about other small stuff. Edit, punctuation and a typo. Do I eye it? I would cry. This is very thoughtful and adorable, but don't buy the extra pads. You don't know yet what kind she prefers, or if she's allergic to the scented etc. But do buy her sweets and hot water bottle plushes and flowers and leave it on her doorstep. Don't try to stay, because she's probably not in the mood for company. Hope she keeps you. Don't get the pads, but favorite snacks and drinks and foodies, so f nice I would cry. Do it, bro. It's almost necessary. As a female currently on her period, I would marry a guy that did this for me okay that's a little dramatic, thank the hormones haha, but no. Too many guys just brush off this stuff, so a guy actually giving a rest would be a big deal for me. Jesus I really wish guys wouldn't be so scared or judged for showing women they like that they care. The whole simp thing is stupid and invented by men who are too useless and lazy to bother putting effort into a relationship so they try to drag others to their level. Be a nice guy. I'm sure she'll absolutely love it and really appreciate it. And if she doesn't then you know she's not the one for you. As a female, I'd be content with just my favorite snacks. Personally I wouldn't want a guy buying my pads, but maybe a reusable heating pad would be nice. The sentiment is so sweet, and I'd melt if a guy did this for me. Do it. I think this is a really sweet gesture, but like other commenters have said, you can forego the pads, since girls usually have a good supply for that, and you don't know the exact brand that she used, and what pad she prefers. I would feel pretty awkward too to have a guy hand me a pad. I'm a girl, and I'd recommend skipping the pads for someone you're not in a relationship with and don't know her favorite brands, but ask her if it's okay to stop by and bring some stuff and get her some snacks and candy. If the guy I've been seeing for 2 months did this for me, I think it would be sweet. I'd skip the feminine products, unless she mentioned running low, ask her what brand slash type she uses. But the food and snacks is a super sweet gesture and shows you care. 100% do it. Skip pads. Please. For the love of god. Learn that being kind isn't a defect. I've seen simp used everywhere in every context and it's legit cringe. I think this is absolutely adorable if you guys are dating as in you're already in a relationship and not just going on dates. You cannot be a simp towards someone you're already with. I'm very much in the camp of do it. But also don't overdo it. Put like no more than $50 towards it. Total. It shows that you care. You're thoughtful. You know she isn't in the best of moods right now. Etc. If taking it to her school slash work slash whatever. Make the bulk of it anonymous. Unmark cardboard box. If directly to her home I suppose it doesn't matter, unless she's with her parents in which case maybe anonymous box. This is a way down the line thing. But one of the things my mom would occasionally brag about, years ago, was that she never had to go underwear shopping. My dad bought her all the bras and panties she could want, both for comfort and for sex appeal. Not saying it's something you should do even in the first few years, 
but things like that have the opportunity to grow, evolve, and remain relevant. Being nice to the person you're dating is not being a simp. I'd love if my boyfriend did this for me.